my God. I don't know if there is any Czech Republicness or something. Um, I I've never had the idea that we, we we have something like uh, that everyone in Czech Republic has inside or something. I think we are still very, you know, there are many varieties of people in our in our uh, republic. As I think it's in Poland is the same. I think more uh, about. For example, what you, you're talking about, about his uh, Polish roots, uh, his Polish identity, is settled in his music, so you can feel the, you know, the Polish, uh, for example, uh, national songs or something in it, but I don't know if there is something, uh, you know, common for all Polish people or all Czech people, I, I don't think so. Of course, when I, when I sing Baroque music, I always find myself trying to imitate such instruments like oboe is, or uh, for example, cornetto, which is uh, great to imitate when you're a soprano, of course. But here it was different because I don't have much experiences of, uh, you know, with singing this kind of music and with historical piano. So I, it was a very new experience for me and I didn't try to imitate, I just tried to, you know, flow with the instrument and try to, try to get together with it as, as much as possible. I have no idea because I think that the things that we know about Chopin were maybe are not what Chopin was exactly. We just know a little bit about, about his life. We know maybe some letters, something like that, but we don't know exactly what person, what kind of person he was. But I must say that uh, when listening to his music, I think he could have a chance. <laughs>